Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers.
Shit up, dude.
something that is just uh, very disturbing and embarrassing. It would have been nice and we would have all been happy if this fight against corruption had some form of direction. In recent times, he could be termed as a self-proclaimed defender of the Patriotic Front PF as he was representing the fallen party in legal battles. However, Saturday 3rd December 2022, the country woke up to a rude shock of Mr. Ngulube's demise. On hand to confirm this news, acting president of the opposition PF Given Lubinda said, a very, very heavy heart that I have to announce the demise of one of us, the demise of uh, a member of the Central Committee, former member of Parliament for, Quat for Kabwe, our lawyer, our good friend in the name of Honorable Tutu Angulube who passed on early this morning. In taking turns, some members of the Patriotic Front described the late Mr. Ngulube as a patriot soldier who defended the rights of the Zambians. In the rule of law, his demise is a big, big loss, not only to the PF, but also to the law fraternity. Because at a tender age, like he was, he was full of wisdom as if he was a 70, 80 year old man. In terms of the law, he was one lawyer who used to do a lot of research because when you went to court, he could court the law without looking in the book correctly to defend you in court. I feel heartbroken. Yeah. It is a loss, not only for the country, for the party, for the family. It is a personal loss. So, Tutwa was a fearless, towering legal mind. He was a very dedicated counsel. He always gave his very best to his clients, and I can attest to it. I remember Tutwa in 2014 in Kabwe at Murungoshi Yoroko Authority when we were electing the successor to President Sata. Tutwa was our presiding or our retaining officer. I remember how firmly he stood and protected the, the, the interests of democracy. Losing a vibrant young lawyer like Tutu, who stood for justice. It is quite, uh, uh, it is quite heartbreaking. And I would uh, describe him as a very brave young man. You know, a lawyer who was intelligent, uh, who represented his clients very well. And he made sure that people whose rights were being violated, whether it be by previous governments or even by the present ones, those who called on him, he was ready to go and assist them. So the country is going to miss a very able lawyer, a very eloquent and very intelligent lawyer. He also worked as a deputy chief whip in parliament, if you remember when we were in government. And he led the politicians or the MPs for PF at least very, very well in the House. So even the MPs for the Party Front and Central Committee itself is going to miss him. Talk to all of us as a PF family and on my own behalf as a bomber, we have, re have received this uh, uh, news uh, uh, with shock. Uh, Tutu and I were in the same uh, life of parliament from 2016 uh, to 2021 uh, and his contribution in parliament towards the uh, growth of this country, it was amazing. He was a soldier, a very courageous uh, young man. Very active member of parliament and uh, concerned a citizen to make sure that uh, uh, Kawe developed. You remember that uh, at one time Kawe was said to be a ghost town and that our people suffered um, injuries out of uh, pollution that was in Kawe. So we had uh, a program that we were working with the World Bank to try and reduce and ensure that um, a young people are protected. Honorable Tutu Angruwe was very instrumental to ensure that uh, the livelihood of people of Kawe and beyond Kawe in this central province was uplifted. So, however, the opposition PF Information and Publicity Secretary Rafael Nakachinda has a different view. And it so happened that I was assigned to interact with the Mabutu What was reviewed in our interaction was that he was worried about his life because he had been receiving messages of threats, uh, both from within Lusaka as well as in Kabul. Um, 
and uh, to that effect, we are concerned on the death of Onusmo We hope that the family will not uh, consider our comments to be mere political rhetoric, but they will take seriously uh, our request that they uh, uh, insist on a due diligence to be undertaken. One, to insist that the samples that may have been initially taken to examine what could have been wrong um, be utilized uh, now and that a postmortem also be undertaken and possibly undertaken by an independent pathologist, forensic pathologist, to be able to ascertain the cause of death. Though Mr. Ngulube will be mainly remembered for his boldness, especially in choice of legal battles, he was at times found at the wrong side, such as threatening to break bones of the youth. We want to urge our youths to say anyone who would participate in such kind of activities will be treated as a law breaker. And we urge the police, when you detain such people, don't even give them police bond. Let the people of Zambia live their lives in peace. We cannot be uh, incited every time one politician or one NGO is not happy with anything, they should take our people in the streets. The police must be ready for them, break their bonds if possible. Let the people know that a lawbreaker is a lawbreaker. Regardless, his death has left the country and the political scene in our. For Movie TV News, Diambela Mutomba in Lusaka. You have suddenly to behave now. Hey, hey. You know that you cannot treat me like a fool. No, we are. I can also behave the way you are behaving. You understand? Yeah, I have respected myself. I like have respected myself. I am not a thief. I am ready to go in those cells. But when I come out, you come and I will share your pension. You understand what I'm telling you? You are the only police officer pushing me around. Hmm? You are happy with the way you carried me like a criminal. Don't behave like you are not a police officer. All these people who are seeing here, they are actually looking at me. I'm an MP. I'm a lawyer. I'm a businessman. I'm not a thief. Tell Prince Chireshe, the money that he has paid you will finish one day. You understand? I will sleep in cells. I don't care. I can stay there for one year. I am a man. I was born a man and I'm ready to suffer for the truth. I am suffering because of the people I'm defending here in Kabwe Central. The people where Prince Chireshe wants to demolish their houses. The people who are suffering because of a thief that we put in the office of mayor and I am ready to suffer with the people. I will go in cells right now. Let me go. No, no, no. Go and bring my gene from the car. Can I be scared of sales? Go and bring my gene from the car. I am going to sales. Not scared of anybody. You understand? Yes, sir. Can be scared of you. Because of what? We came together all the way. You come and misbehave from me. I am going. I'm not scared. But you will pay. I'm telling you the truth. You especially, Kabanda, for pushing me like that. You understand? There is a group of people that has been sent to come and harass me. Okay? The police are aware. So I have decided not to come on my own. I've come with someone I trust. And as I am sitting, there's someone behind me. They want to remove the person behind me so that he doesn't say anything. I know you after my life. No. I'm telling you, you, you know where are you coming from? Where are you there when you were threatening to shoot me? You Zambia police are after my life. I'm telling you the truth. This time around, I'm ready to be embarrassed again. I am not going to the world must 
You can't just me, I'm a senior government official. I want some understand. You are supposed to be saluting to me. To come out. Only the rules are under. Where is the Shiva coming from? 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 You can't. You disturb a presidential meeting. You can't behave like that. Can you go? EF conducts itself. He himself, my younger brother, is has got an attribute to him of breaking bonds. If you just turn off the cameras, you may find that my bonds are broken. <laughs> and I want you to know that in this country, law is administered selectively. If I issued exactly that statement that Honorable Bongulube issued about breaking people's bonds, as was the case when um, our former vice president, you know the fat one? Issued in a metaphor. Wait, 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 in a Wait, matter. I we don't Jared, know. Who, who took who? that video, first of all, of me saying we should break people's bonds? Where is the video? Let me is that video authentic? Yes, no, no, no. Is that video authentic? Please, the please do not. One, do not. one vice president of ours in the past used a metaphor that I'm going to come for your throat. He spent almost two years in court. Here's an MP who threatened to break bonds whose bonds did i uh, to ask break? the police to break the youths disgruntled youths but let me come to your question we want to urge our youths to say anyone who participates in such kind of activities who be treated as a law breaker and we urge the police when you detain such people don't even give them police bond let the people of zambia live their lives in peace we cannot be uh, incited every time one politician or one ngo is not happy with anything they should take our people in the streets. The police must be ready for them, break their bonds if possible. Let the people know that a lawbreaker is a lawbreaker. I thank you. 30 seconds, unfortunately. In my 30 seconds, I want to challenge Honore Bunkombo to prove to me that the purported video where bones. people are saying that me, I said, break their bonds was actually me speaking about breaking their bonds. And I think this social media that people have now developed where they can put words in someone's mouth and make a white president speak like a bimba man, we, we are above that. <laughs> First of all, I also want to tell you, Honor Bonkombo, that if you can prove to me that there is such a video and it was taken by a person who identifies himself and comes and says, I'm the one who took this video and you tell me where that video was taken from, I would definitely congratulate you. Incited every time one politician or one NGO is not happy with anything, they should take our people in the streets. The police must be ready for them, break their bonds if possible. Let the people know that a lawbreaker is a lawbreaker. I thank you. <laughs> if you can prove to me that there is such a video and it was taken by a person who identifies himself and comes and says, I'm the one who took this video and you tell me where that video was taken from, I would definitely congratulate you.
Israel, my colleagues who bring the rich of the world. That is the I've respected myself, I am not a thief. I'm ready to go in those sales. But when I come out, you come and I will share your pension. You understand what I'm telling you? You are the only police officer pushing me around. Hmm? You are happy with the way you carried me like a criminal. Don't behave like you are not a police officer. All these people who are seeing here, they are actually looking at me. I'm an MP, I'm a lawyer, I'm a businessman, I'm not a thief. Tell Prince Shireshe, the money that he has paid you will finish one day. You understand? I will sleep in cells. I don't care. I can stay there for one year. I am a man. I was born a man and I'm ready to suffer for the truth. I am suffering because of the people I'm defending here in Kabwe Central. The people where the Prince Yesha wants to demolish their houses. The people who are suffering because of a thief that we put in the office of mayor and I am ready to suffer with the people. I will go in cells right now. Not scared of anybody. You understand? Yes, sir. Can be scared of you because of what? We came together all the way you come and misbehave from me. I am going. I'm not scared. But you will pay. I'm telling you the truth. You especially, Kabanda, for pushing me like that. You understand? Oh. 
That man was a brave man, I'm telling you. And please, I want to appeal. This time is not the time for you to start like I'm a politics. No. Put aside politics. Russia no muntu. Never buy bread to go to Wushkubaku Fiarwa. Wushkubaku 
kufwa gwali wa mapo kuchiro bushiku bwa kufyalwa bantu bushiku bwa kufwa bekesa kumona bengi so lekeni tubalire mu mutende tubalire mu chibote kali tukaba shindike please na papata lekeni le somu inalu abaluile ngayani lufiengo tuwalisha mwe bana bakwalesa kwali bempa sha lufiengo but we can't say that ya ni mpo ya lufiengo we monele to bamutsire le somu ine wishibe le somu ine wishibe mwe bana bakwalesa ifo tuli bantu fe kuti tuwasaba ila tuwalande fingana tu mwe pa social media kuri aba ni attack kuri aba cho nyani kani eh aba mine pressure bradjuko eh chanchanuko uya mininoko uya fioninako uya lande mwe bana bakwalesa na papata na papata tu alalanda ne pata tfiro okulanda lekenu mwine lesa alande ngari tusumi nisho kwa ati nishita yako nishita yako we ichintu chose mwane chari kwa ati nishita nishita nga naifika nishi naifika tetu isule yyo tetu butuke batu utu angurube nga bari shoko ati ngana kuruse koko nga afuila nga bari na kukabwe pantu tu achupo kwa ati batu utu angurube bafu ni maru kukabwe lelo wachilinga noko wako mko metisha ni miti miyabo nga bari kukabwe nga tabashi yeko kuruse kwa ati pavo wisho kwa ati koko ndea ndea mkufwa wane tuwe ndane mfwa mpwa yesu ya wapamubili as long as umona wesu waso ntapanshi chitura ngoko wa chuka nushelova as long as nushala kuikana ngusanse perfume ya 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 20 pin usanse perfume ya shanuko nushale kuikana alando kwe wati ichimubili chikabola so mweba na bakuwa lesa isen tulile watu utwa mchibote kari tulile mwini lesa leso mwine wishibi ifin tu kubalansa blues lastly my condolences to the family and my father my brother tutu angulube may you so rest in peace until we meet again amen All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.